Hey, good morning YouTube. Welcome to another Monday Morning Coffee Chat. I'm glad that you took the time to, to join us today. As most of you know, I have had a slow going time getting my, my homestead together. I'm busy and I imagine all of you guys are busy and it's, it's difficult at times. And so earlier this week we were going to try to put in a fence for our chickens because it's getting time to plant our gardens and we don't want our chickens roaming around and eating all of our plants. So we got to pin them in, so to speak. So we're going to put a little fence around their, their coop and I'll be showing you that in the future. But I needed to dig some holes and I didn't have a set of post hole diggers so I went to uh, the local box store and the cheapest set I could find was $50. $50 for a set of post hole diggers and I thought well man that's that's ridiculous and so I, I left there and I thought man I'll look on, on Craigslist or something see if I can find a, a cheaper set and I drove down the street probably less than a mile uh, and there was a gentleman out that has a, an antique store slash thrift junk store kind of a thing and out in the front he had this big barrel that had all of these tools in it and uh, I stopped and I got there and I walked up and lo and behold he had a set of post hole diggers very nice set actually uh, good quality steel handles are, are wooden and in really good shape and so with not much work these will be uh, a phenomenal set of post hole diggers and I bought them and uh, another tool and I said how much for your tools I said ten dollars a piece and I said, well, that, that sure beats 50, so I bought one set, and then I grabbed the other tool, and he said, if you buy two, I'll give them to you for 15 bucks. So two tools, $15, and just a mile up the road, I was going to spend $50 on one set of post hole diggers. It's amazing if you'll take the time to look around and try to find these deals, how much money you can save. I have decided that I'm, I'm never going to buy another new tool again unless I desperately need it. It just there's just no sense in it. So I'm going to put in an hour's worth of work on these two tools, and they're going to be just as good or better than the tool I could have bought at Home Depot uh, right off the shelf. And there's just no comparison when you start talking about cost. And if if your goal really is to to homestead, to be more self-sufficient, self-reliant, you've got to learn to save money where you can. And this is a great place, a great way to save some money. Vintage tools, tools that you can pick up for, for literally pennies on the dollar compared to brand new. Put a little bit of work into it, put a wire brush into it, make a new handle out of it. it, it there's just no comparison. You, you've got to do that. You've got to go out and try to find those. And on top of all of that, something else that happened was I got to spend some time with that local businessman. And we exchanged names and I told him who I was and what I was doing. He told me a little bit about him and his past and a relationship is formed, a business relationship is formed. And so I will definitely go back to him in the future and, and patronize his business. And that's the way it works as consumer and, and, and a business. And it's just, it's just it's a win-win situation. So instead of going to your local box store and picking up a tool that's overpriced, that's made in China, that's been shipped literally tens of thousands of miles to get here, go to your local businessman go to an antique shop, go to a thrift store, and develop a relationship with those folks. They'll help you out. And uh, this guy, he's even going to call me. I'm, I'm in search of an anvil right now. And he's even going to call me if he happens to come across one. So it's just a win-win. You're not going to get that kind of service at Home Depot. So better prices, better service. There's just there's no comparison whatsoever. So go out, find you some antique tools, put some elbow grease in them, make them work again and you will definitely benefit in the long run. God bless you guys. Have a great, safe day. Now go out there and do something about it.